I'm going to dye some white fabric purple with the purple dye made out of grape peels. By the way, I'm wearing a mask to remind everyone that we're still in a big pandemic and we should still always wear a mask when we go to crowded places. So before I start with any fabric at all, you, I need to make the, the dye. So first, I, I am getting a large amount of grape peels. Actually, we've been saving grape peels for like two days in a row. And so I'm putting this in a pot. I hope it fits. That's better. <laughs> okay, so now that it all fits in, I'm going to add some water, not too much. Like as much water as I have, like grape peels. And so this is a 1 8 cup measuring spoon I have. And this is distilled white vinegar from this bucket, except this is too heavy, so we. So I'm gonna measure out 1 8 of a cup. white vinegar and pour it over into the mixture. And so I'm going to put the thing on the stove. So now the water is beginning to boil. So for 10 minutes to get the color out. And by the way, this is a type of Asian grape with really thick skin that's easier to peel off. It's called Jifeng grape. And I've tried California grapes before, but the peels are thinner and harder to peel off and takes twice as much time. Okay, so a couple of hours have passed. It's cool enough and I've already strained out the grape peels. And so I'm gonna take this t-shirt, um, fold it up and just squish it in this bowl of grape peel juice. put in this for 30 minutes or an hour. Okay, so an hour or so has passed and this cloth is completely purple. And by the way, the sun's starting to go down so the color might be a little off. So I'm going to squeeze out the tons of extra juice. By the way, this is salt from this container. And so I'm going to add this salt to a bowl of water, stir it a little so it melts because this is to make the color more stable. 
And so I'm going to put the purple fabric in and sort of like wash it. Okay, so it's soaked for already more than 30 minutes and it's getting dark outside, so we're moving it in. So I'm going to wring this out the best. Okay, thing. so it's already wrung out reasonably dry and ta-da, it looks like this. See how it's purple? So the color will probably get lighter when it dries, but it's actually a pretty dark purple. Thanks for watching.